Hi, in this video I want to show you how a player's game can be analyzed using video analysis. We can look at the strokes, the movement, and how competitively a player plays when playing match play points. Let's have a look. These video clips are of Elizabeth playing a tennis tournament in January of 2014. All the video clips are of her serving points. I like her serve. I like her ritual of bouncing balls before she's ready to serve. This is important to develop a ritual because it will help you be more consistent in making good serves. If you notice in the videos, she really likes to dominate points using her forehand ground stroke. Also, by watching the video, I can see that she moves well side to side on the baseline. There's one area she needs to work on, and that's handling a deeply hit ball to her and having to move back away from the baseline. It's one of the, the skills we've worked on this year, trying to improve her up and back movement. As you can tell in the videos also, she likes to try to finish points from inside the baseline. That's key to her game. She doesn't want to be a long rally type player. When she gets the opportunity on a short ball, she wants to step inside the baseline, and finish the points off. Again, these videos show her serve. It's very important to develop a good serve. It is one of those strokes that you can work on consistently on your own. In the next video clips, Patrick's playing a tournament in January of 2015. He likes to hit his forehand better than his backhand. He doesn't step into the backhand very well, and that's one of the things we'll need to work on with this game. Also, his service motion needs to be corrected. We're laying a new grip right now, allowing him to get more spin on the ball. In a lot of these clips, he's also losing points by hitting balls into the net. It's very important to try to keep the ball out of the net, because you never give your opponent a chance to lose a point if the ball hits the net. One more thing I want to see Patrick work on is when he's playing a point, he tends to flip his racket around and his hand a lot. And that makes it difficult always to find the right grip. It's a bit of a nervous habit, and he probably doesn't even realize he's doing it. Some of the things I really like about Patrick's game are his ability to come forward and he's very strong. He's not afraid to hit the ball. And that's good because he, again, doesn't want to be in long rallies. If he gets a short ball, he's going to learn that it's very important just to step inside the baseline and try and finish the point. Video analysis is a great tool to use to improve your game. You can study your strokes, your movement, and how you compete when playing real points. Thanks for watching my video.